Welcome to the iconic world of the Magnificent Seven, a 1960 classic that stands as a testament to the enduring allure of the Western genre. As you revisit this cinematic gem, perhaps you find yourself pondering, do you have a cherished memory associated with this movie? Or was there a classic Hollywood actor in this ensemble cast who captured your admiration? Before we delve into the heart of the film, consider sharing your most cherished memory or personal experience related to The Magnificent Seven. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Now, let's set the stage with some intriguing tidbits about the movie. Did you know that The Magnificent Seven is a remake of Akira Kurosawa's Seven Samurai, reimagined in a Western setting? This shift in cultural context adds a unique layer to the film's narrative, blending honor and heroism against the rugged backdrop of the American frontier. Featuring a star-studded cast, one classic Hollywood actor inevitably stole the spotlight for many viewers. Whether it's Yul Brynner's stoic presence or Steve McQueen's magnetic charm, the ensemble cast contributed to the film's enduring legacy. As you revisit The Magnificent Seven, take a moment to reflect on the moments that resonate with you. Was it the breathtaking landscapes, the iconic score, or the camaraderie of the seven protagonists? Share your thoughts and join the conversation below. What memories does this timeless classic evoke for you? We're eager to hear your insights and anecdotes. Share your thoughts in the comments section and let the conversation flow. The Magnificent Seven, directed by John Sturges in 1960, is a classic Western film inspired by Akira Kurosawa's Seven Samurai. The story unfolds as a small Mexican village, tormented by a ruthless bandit named Calvra, seeks the help of seven skilled gunmen to defend them. Each member of the diverse group, including the iconic characters played by actors like Yol Brynner and Steve McQueen, brings a unique set of skills and personality to the ensemble. The film is renowned for its dynamic storytelling, memorable dialogue, and compelling action sequences. The collaboration of these seven protagonists, initially motivated by financial gain, transforms into a noble pursuit of justice as they train and lead the villagers in a battle against Calvara's forces. This timeless tale of courage and camaraderie captivates audiences with its blend of tension, humor, and moral depth. The success of The Magnificent Seven not only established it as a cinematic gem, but also influenced subsequent films, television shows, and the Western genre as a whole. Its impact on popular culture endures, making it an enduring symbol of heroism and solidarity in the face of adversity, a testament to the film's lasting legacy. The Magnificent Seven's unique blend of character-driven narrative and action set a standard that resonates in storytelling to this day, solidifying its place as a cornerstone of cinematic history. Elmer Bernstein's iconic score for The Magnificent Seven remains one of the most recognized in film history. Interestingly, Bernstein also composed the score for the parody film Three Amigos, showcasing his versatility in capturing the essence of both classic westerns and comedic counterparts. In terms of on-screen dynamics, a unique aspect adds a layer to the characters. Yul Brynner, standing at 510, was determined to maintain a visual height advantage over Steve McQueen, who was 5912. Brynner went to the extent of creating a small mound of earth to stand on during scenes with McQueen ensuring a subtle yet deliberate height difference between the two actors. Delving into the characters, Vin, portrayed by Steve McQueen, stands out for his distinctive approach to handling a handgun. Unlike his counterparts who opt for a single-handed grip, Vin employs a two-handed grip, steadying his shooting hand with his left hand during the final shootout. This nuanced detail not only reflects McQueen's dedication to authenticity, but also contributes to Vin's character's precision in the heat of battle. In summary, beyond the cinematic brilliance and narrative depth of The Magnificent Seven, the film's behind-the-scenes anecdotes and character intricacies provide a fascinating glimpse into the craftsmanship that brought this classic to life. Yul Brynner's commitment to his role in The Magnificent Seven went beyond the screen. On set, he not only portrayed the charismatic leader Chris Adams, but also entered into a personal union he got married. The wedding celebration cleverly utilized props from the movie's fiesta scene, adding a touch of reality to the real-life festivities. However, the movie's depth extends beyond Brenner's personal milestones. Notably, James Coburn, one of the seven gunfighters, was a devoted fan of Seven Samurai, the Japanese film that inspired The Magnificent Seven. Coburn, who played the role originally portrayed by Seiji Miyaguchi, deliberately incorporated Miyaguchi's performance as Kuzo into his own. This nuanced connection adds a layer of appreciation for the film, 
highlighting the influence of international cinema on Hollywood adaptations. Interestingly, the original script envisioned the seven gunfighters as older veterans of the U.S. Civil War. Spencer Tracy, a renowned actor of his time, was suggested for the role of Chris. However, casting decisions evolved, leading to the assembly of a diverse group of gunmen that ultimately defined the film's iconic ensemble cast. As we delve into the behind-the-scenes anecdotes of The Magnificent Seven, it becomes evident that the film's impact reaches beyond the silver screen. From personal celebrations to transcontinental inspiration, the movie stands as a testament to the convergence of diverse influences, both on and off camera. In casting The Magnificent Seven, director John Sturges faced a pivotal decision for the role of Brit. James Coburn, recommended by Robert Vaughn, fit the sought-after Gary Cooper type. Vaughn's influence played a crucial role in securing Coburn's position among the seven gunmen. This collaboration not only defined Coburn's career, but also added a layer of camaraderie behind the scenes. Behind the camera, screenwriter Walter Newman clashed with Sturges over the portrayal of certain characters. Newman objected to Sturges reallocating lines from Yo Brenner to Steve McQueen and Charles Bronson, prompting him to distance himself from the credits. However, the subsequent reunion for The Great Escape showcased the resilience of their professional relationship, highlighting the complex dynamics and bringing the magnificent seven to life. On a different front, the bond formed by the bandit gang hired for Calvara adds an intriguing dimension. Eli Wallach, portraying the ruthless leader, became part of their camaraderie, sharing horse rides and entrusting the gang with checks on his gear. This off-screen connection reflects the depth of collaboration that extended beyond the script, showcasing the unique dynamics that shaped the making of this cinematic gem. In summary, the casting decisions, creative clashes, and off-screen bonds played pivotal roles in shaping the narrative and dynamics of The Magnificent Seven. These behind-the-scenes glimpses offer a fascinating perspective on the intricate web of relationships and decisions that contributed to the enduring legacy of this classic Western, a testament to the complexities that define the art of filmmaking. As the sun sets on this cinematic journey, I invite you to linger in the afterglow of the Magnificent Seven. Let the dust of the Old West settle around you as you reflect on the timeless tale of valor, camaraderie, and the indomitable human spirit. Perhaps you find echoes of your own struggles and triumphs mirrored in the rugged landscapes these seven warriors tread. Are there moments in the film that resonate with the ebb and flow of your own life? Let the melodies of Elmer Bernstein's iconic score weave through the recesses of your memories, summoning forth a nostalgic dance with the past. This is more than just a movie. It's a living tapestry of emotions, a canvas where every brushstroke reveals a different facet of the human experience. Have you found solace in the quiet strength of Chris Adams or drawn inspiration from the rebellious spirit of Vin Tanner? The Magnificent Seven isn't just a story, it's a mirror reflecting the complex mosaic of our own narratives. Your reflections are the missing brush strokes, the unwritten verses that complete this masterpiece. I implore you to share your thoughts, your musings, your personal connection to this cinematic gem. Unearth the memories that have been tucked away in the recesses of your mind and let them breathe anew. In this digital campfire we've gathered around, your stories become the sparks that illuminate the collective appreciation for the Magnificent Seven. Every comment, every sentiment adds a layer to the collective memory we're forging together. Thank you for joining this exploration into the heart of a classic. Your time, your thoughts, and your connection make this journey richer and more vibrant. Until we meet again in the cinematic landscapes of shared experiences, keep the spirit of the Magnificent Seven alive in your reflections.